developers welcome back to all of you once again my name is nikhil all the way from india so this is part 4 of portal development tutorial and in this video tutorial you will explore how to configure angular js for ui pages ultimately we supposed to work using widget editor of a particular widget after widget creation however i recommend you to be started using angular js so that it would be clear for you to understand angular js directives and functions so let's go ahead without wasting our precious time so here friend what is angular js it is mbc based javascript framework mbc stands for model view and controller model it is the lowest level of pattern responsible for maintaining data so a friend model basically used to maintain data it responds to the request from the view and to instruct sun from the controller to update itself basically we request through the view and based on our request controller will update the model controller updates the model and view is nothing but our html code html template where we represent data and we can represent data using this expression that is opening double curly bracket and closing double curly bracket inside that we can write controller variable to represent data and here controller as you know it controls the functionality and perform interactions between models and views it responds to the user input and performs interactions on the data model objects so here for learning angular js you can use ui pages let's follow this steps to configure so let's copy this ui and paste here so after that you will get uh, this snippets or quotes you can say just copy this and from the application navigator type ui script okay and uh, let's create new ui script and let's name it as angular underscore js angular underscore mean underscore js okay that's it and select type as all okay and save it paste here inside this script field and let's prettify it and save and the second create a new ui script record okay we already did we have created ui script record and we have pasted the quotes from here and after that create a new ui page okay so let's create a new ui page from the application navigator type ui pages and under this system ui application you could see this model ui pages let's open a new tab and uh create new what we can say learning angular js okay the name and i recommend you to we followed this uh, naming convention which is snake guess and as you know that jelly script doesn't support angular js code so that's why we are configuring to use angular js in ui page and let's save it okay and 
सो हियर आफ्टर दिस ओपनिंग टैग डेली टैग to copy this okay uh, you can write manually okay and this is the ui script api name so i have to copy this and just paste here okay and for to check whether our angular js code will work or not let's copy this code okay i will tell you what all this is there uh, so there is no option here to prettify this team okay and just save it okay uh maybe okay so here you could see the input uh, tag is open but there is no closing tag for this input tag what we can do we can close itself okay using this forward slash Just save it and let's uh, duplicate current tab and if you will click try it it will execute this agile uh, script code so here you can see let me zoom in so see okay now it is supporting angular js and only we have to do is that